I'll be presenting today's Radiopedia.org case in radiology, hypoxic ischemic encephalopathy. Case courtesy is demonstrated here, and the case link is in the description below. Presentation, we have an 80-year-old male with prolonged CPR after cardiac arrest after PCI. The patient is not waking up 24 hours after stopping sedation. The patient's pupils are non-reactive to light. On CT, we can appreciate effacement of the sulcal spaces, secondary to diffuse cerebral edema. Also, the normal attenuation of the grain white matter is reversed in areas, and this is the reversal sign. Additionally, we see that the cerebellum has higher attenuation in comparison to the cerebral hemispheres. This is the white cerebellum sign. The basal cisterns demonstrate relative increased attenuation due to cerebral edema simulating subarachnoid hemorrhage. This is called pseudo-subarachnoid hemorrhage. Hypoxic ischemic encephalopathy or global hypoxic ischemic injury is a common unfortunate consequence of prolonged resuscitation after cardiac arrest. The white cerebellum sign and reversal sign indicate irreversible brain injury and very poor prognosis.